This is George. George is a Roomba. You like George, don't you, Stinky? So, I have a Roomba. Its name's George, and um, George does the hoovering for me. And the reason that this is relevant to Anorexia Recovery YouTube channel is one of my kind of movement weirdnesses was that I hoovered my house or my flat or wherever I was living every day. You know, I would even go to other people's houses and hoover theirs. Who does that? That's how sad I was. I, you know why? It's because it was an excuse to move, wasn't it? And um, so, I love that I have a Roomba because basically that means that I don't hoover, I just let George do it. And you know what? George isn't actually that good. If you look closely at the floor, I mean, he does an all right job, but if you look closely at the floor, it's not that dirt, it's not that clean. I don't care. <laughs> Which is another thing that's different about me because when I had anorexia, I think I would have cared a lot more. I'd been like, no, that room, but doesn't do it properly. I have to slave over the floor and get down on my hands and knees and scrub it. And now I'm just like, yeah, it's good enough. The cats are only going to fuck it up anyway. So what's the point? Stinky, basically, like George does the, ho the hoovering and then Stinky just sheds all over it. So, and Dave's just as bad. Not to even mention the dogs, apart from Worm is theoretically hairless. So she doesn't shed, but... She still, like, rips up pieces of cardboard. So does Stinky. It's his favourite game. So the floor's always a mess anyway. George does an okay job. It's good enough for me. I love that my brain doesn't actually care about these things anymore. And I love that my brain does not feel bad about the fact that I'm sitting on the couch while George is doing the vacuuming for me. That's very different than when I had anorexia. When I had anorexia, I would be any opportunity to move... There's no way I'd let a robot do the hoovering and take away that opportunity to move for me. It's really wonderful being quite normal. And, um, you know, that's what life is like when you're fully recovered. Much fewer shits given about things that really don't matter at all. This is how Stinky and I do the cleaning, isn't it, Bob?